What's up guys, so I'm going to show you how you could get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your own creative island the easiest and the fastest way possible. But real quick, I am gifting tons of you guys whatever you do want from the Fortnite item shop, including anything from the Dragon Ball Z Super Collaboration and the Season 3 Battle Pass. So if there is something that you do want right now from the Fortnite item shop, just subscribe Subscribe with the notifications, like the video, and then go and comment your Epic Games Gamer tag and what you do want from the Fortnite item shop, and I'm going to be gifting tons of you guys whatever you do want from the Fortnite item shop. And also guys, if you would like to support the channel, please consider using support creator code YGT inside of the Fortnite item shop, hashtag add. But now let's go ahead and get straight in to how you could go ahead and get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island super easily and super fast, the easiest and the fastest way possible, guys. So to go ahead and get started, guys, we're just going to go ahead and open up the Discovery menu, and we're going to go ahead and load right into Creative, just like how I am right now. Hold up, I selected the wrong game mode. Let me just go ahead and select Creative real quick. Here we go, Creative, and we're going to go ahead and load into our Creative island and i'm going to show you how you could get and save the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha inside of your own fortnite creative island the easiest and the fastest way possible guys this is really really crazy and this is really really good because i know a lot of you guys like this brand new mythic that is inside of fortnite so what we're going to want to do, guys to save and get the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha and save it inside of your Fortnite Creative Island, this easiest and the fastest way possible. Once you guys are loaded inside of Creative, guys, to go ahead and get this mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island, guys, what we're going to want to do, we're just going to want to go over to our island, just like how I am right now. So just go over to your Creative Island, just like how I am right now. Now, once you are inside of your Creative Island, guys, just like how I am right here, right now, guys, what we are going to want to go ahead and basically do. So we're going to want to go ahead and just land somewhere. You could land anywhere on your Creative Island. You just want to go ahead and land somewhere. Now, once you do land somewhere, you want to go ahead and basically open up your creative menu, right? So, to go ahead and get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your own Fortnite creative island, the easiest and the fastest way possible, guys, what you're going to want to go ahead and do to do this, guys, this is really, really easy, and this is really, really fast as well to go ahead and do. So, what we are going to want to go ahead and do, guys... To go ahead and get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island. So once you open up your menu, just like how I have right here, right now, you're going to see My Island Creative and play right so under my island you're going to see like game settings ui tools description permissions right underneath creative you're going to see preferables you're going to see galleries you're going to see devices weapons consumables chests level right then to the right of that, you're going to see play, which is going to show your loadout and all of that stuff, right? So what we're going to want to do to get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island, the easiest and the fastest way possible, guys. If we look to the right of my island and to the left of play, you're going to see creative, right? Now, if we look to the right of preferables, to the right of gallery, you're going to see this tab called devices. It's to the left of weapons and consumables. So to go to go ahead and get, the, get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic it kamehameha inside of your own fortnite creative island guys the easiest and the fastest way possible guys what we're going to want to do once we are inside of devices guys so if we look at the first row underneath the first row underneath the second row underneath the third row underneath the fourth row underneath the fifth row underneath the eighth row under the ninth under the tenth under the eleventh under the twelfth under the thirteenth under fourteenth if you're going to look at the fourteenth row you want to go down to the fourteenth row right the middle item right here you're going to see the vending machine right so what we're going to want to do now 
to go ahead and get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island, guys. Once you do go down and you do go over to where the vending machine is, guys, you are going to want to go ahead and hold down to place now, just like how I have right here, guys. So, now what we're going to want to do, guys, to get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island, guys, super easily, super fast, quickest and fastest way possible possible guys once we have the vending machine out and ready to place you guys just want to place it anywhere so just place one vending machine down as long as it's like on the ground just like this that is perfect now we're about to go ahead and get and save the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha inside of your own fortnite creative island super easily and super fast which is honestly super super amazing guys so what we're gonna want to go ahead and do now guys so to get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island, guys. We are now basically just about to go ahead and get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your Fortnite Creative Island super easily and super fast. So what we're going to do now, we're going to open up the pause menu, right? So now once we do open up the pause menu, guys, you guys want to make sure that you're standing like a few feet back from the vending machine, just like how I am. I am, right? Then once you are standing a few feet back from the vending machine, and just like how I am, and you do open up the pause menu, guys, what we're going to want to do to get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your own Fortnite Creative Island, guys, super easily and super, super fast. You want to go over to the tab that does say Menu, and you're going to see Settings, your producer's feedback, Code of Conduct, Support, Legal, Respawn, Team Select My Island, Back to Hub, Start Game, right? So to get and save the Dragon Ball Z Mythic Kamehameha inside of your own Fortnite Creative Island, the easiest and the fastest way possible, guys, you guys are going to want to go over to where it says respawn just like how i have right now now once we click that we are now in the final step guys and we're just about to get and save the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha inside of your own fortnite creative island the easiest and the fastest way possible guys so what we're gonna want to go ahead and do now guys we are just going to want to go ahead and go back to the vending machine and now we're in the final step to get and save the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha inside of your fortnite creative island so now you want to just stand a few feet back from it again and now as reporting says feedback click on make sure the you click report a bug right just go down to the bottom click on other make sure the vending machine is in the picture continue accept and submit reports just like that what's going to go ahead and happen is epic games is going to email you in a few minutes then you want to tell them they're going Gonna ask you what your problem is and you want to tell them that you basically had the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha inside of your vending machine and it went missing and you don't have any more and then they're going to go ahead and add it into the vending machine they're going to tell you they add it into vending machine now the reason why this works is because they don't know you shouldn't have in creative and they don't know so there's like, all right we just added it back to your vending machine and then just reset your game and it will be in your vending machine they don't know you shouldn't have it and then it's going to be inside of your creative island and that's how you get it and save it inside of your creative island super easily and super fast which is honestly super amazing because you can go ahead and get and save the dragon ball z mythic kamehameha Kamehameha inside of your creative island, which is honestly super crazy because it is a super crazy mythic. So yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe.